Hi guys, welcome back to Irish Footy Vlogs. Welcome back to Match Day Vlog. This time we're back at Daily Man Park to see Bohemian Sec and Drotada. However, we're going to be in the Drotada section, which is interesting. Wore my Drotada jersey just to really piss Billy off today. Is it working? Mm, yeah. End the video. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, an interesting one. It's gonna be interesting in the away end. To be fair, I, have I ever been in? The, I have been in the away end, but I've never been in the way end in the mono stand. Like put it that way, I don't think. No, I haven't. So interesting, just to mix it up a little bit, especially as we've gone to last few vlogs have been pretty much bows. I think at Daily Man's are near enough, but. Um, yeah, it's an interesting game. I mean, Bowes want to keep up their form uh, in terms of Europe. Drogheda, you know, have a little gap at the bottom of the table in terms of the playoff relegation places, if you like, as well. It's an interesting one. Two strikers in top form, to be fair. Afalabi has seven goals in six games for Bowes. Foley, I think, has six goals in seven games for Drogheda. So that's going to be interesting. Adebayega has left Drogheda to join Norwich, of course, as well. So it'll be interesting to see what they do there. Connor Kane is back. Will he start? Will Weir go into centre-back? That'll be interesting to see. Uh, regards Bowes, um, that midfield as well. I wonder if James Clark will start against his old club along with the other James, James McManus. We'll have to see what happens there. And but Adam uh, McDonald could play. Yeah, well, you know, he could play, yeah. But um, I don't know, what do you think of the score, Billy? I'm going to go one all. I think Drogheda might make a point here at the element. 3-1 Bowes, yeah. I think it'll be 3-1 Bowes. 3-1 Bowes, right. I got the last two results actually bang on right, by the way. No, as I, well. got them. I got all of them right. Well, we can look back at the video evidence and suggest that you didn't. There's no video there, evidence. Oh, there is video evidence. I know. Yeah, right. We're going to shut up anyway, so guys, we'll see you in there. <laughs>
Frank Pyle nearly scored twice. <laughs>
Bit lucky. Never It's slightly in the dark here, but um, that was some game, wasn't it? I mean, 4 2, 6 goals. Oh, I don't know, it doesn't tell the story of the game. I can't even remember start. exactly. Um, was it Casper got the first goal, maybe for Bowles yeah, from a got corner? The first um, Bowles started off like a house on fire, did a chance that was cleared off the line. It might have been Connor okay. Keeley, was it? But James Clark took the volley, and then yeah, the yeah, I think it might have been Connor Keeley, but anyway, and I think from the resulting corner, pretty much. I think Bowles uh, scored from that and the marking was deplorable to be honest from draw they won't be happy with that and Bowles started off brilliantly and uh, Evan Will then scores No, draw had come into the game and um, carve Bowles open at will to be honest which is a lot of opportunities Robinson hits the post who had a good game actually and he had another shot that just went wide um, he had a couple of other chances actually in the second half I think in a few weeks uh, another few games under his belt he took away one or two of those but um he, that's good signs for Drotted. He looks sharp, in my opinion. But um, yeah, they carved them open at will. Drotted had a lot of chances, and then Evan Weir scores a header, which makes it one all. And they're in the ascendancy. Bowls are a bit all over the shop, and yeah, well, a minute or two later, Evan Weir gets picks up a red card, which was the right decision, in my opinion. Yeah. Um, he's out of control, unfortunately, and um, there's probably no need for it. I mean, Evan's a good lad. He'll know it himself. Um, he'll be disappointed with that. I do think it was a red card, and. You know, Kevin Doherty mightn't have been happy with that. It probably cost him in the end, if we're honest about it. The legs later on went from Drotted, but, you know, Bowles then, after that, um, had some chances, some goals were disallowed. It was very difficult to see why or how or whatever. Tordic had one disallowed. The Gaffa Lavi might have one disallowed. It's difficult to see how or if were they given offside or what happened, like, you know what I mean? But they were disallowed anyway. But then they went 2 1 up, um, deservedly so Drotted were all over the place at this point as well and Afalabi scored wasn't it to make it 2-1 I think am I right um, I think I'm right haven't I yeah oh, <laughs> we no, think we are lads this is yeah, very yeah, fresh after are, the game you are, you are, you are. Um, and we haven't looked at anything back obviously so just crazy stuff and you know Bowles were looking to get a third before half time and you thought to be honest Bowles would probably go on and win easy um, now it sounded like it was easy in the end 4-2 but not really to be honest second half I think Drotted have kept it tight enough. Uh, again, created some chances. They created some chances. They opened up balls a few times in that second half as well. And eventually, they did get level, didn't they? Yeah, they made it two all. And J- Jamie Egan actually puts it into there after Marky had a lot of space. He finds him. And it's 2 2. So after a lot of chances from Drotted, they got themselves level. And then a minute or two later, <laughs> they kind of shot themselves in the foot here with a penalty. And Wogan, good young goalkeeper, only 17. A little bit of rush of blood to the head. Takes down T- Danny Grant, didn't he? Yeah. Who was clever. Um, and Afalabi was never going to miss that penalty. Nine goals in seven games. It's incredible form from Afalabi. Apart from that, he's playing well. You know, he's just a man possessed at the moment in terms of confidence. He's never going to miss a penalty. 3-2. Trotter naturally got tired and Bowles managed to get a fourth. Um, James Clark. James Clark against his former club strikes it, places it into net, takes it well, very good goal. 
And, um, you know, I feel, I have to admit, though, I think Bowles, good win for Bowles, uh, Billy, but I think they got away with one tonight. I think the red card is a red card, but I'm not so sure to win that game when it's 11 against it's 11. Like- Even in the second half, I thought they were very poor, very poor Bowles, up to the point where um, Drotted obviously got the goal. Um, and then Drotta gave away the penalty. So I think they got away with one balls tonight, if I'm honest with you, in that kind of sense. And Drotta, look, Drotta always give it their best. Every time you see them, they give it their best and, and play till the end. But uh, quick thoughts before we go, will you? Uh, t- uh, too much stuff. Quick thoughts. The, I thought, though, the red card killed the game mm. for Drotta. Mm. Because they it were, did in the were, end, I think. Yeah, they yeah. ran out of legs. Because yeah. they, they were the better team at the time as well. Oh, it was better. Yeah. Be honest, yeah, I don't. I he, he, I don't. It was a red, but mm. he, I don't know why he could. He could have just mm. stood his feet. I don't know. I don't he know. Just, he yeah. came rushing in, mm. tucked in, and kind of lay out. Mm. It's a red. Yeah, yeah. You can't complain. But lads, let's know. There's too much to say. But let's know what you think All of the right. vlog. What should the people do? Don't forget to like and subscribe, <laughs> and don't forget to push your bell notification button for more videos. Cheers, see you.